It's almost one o'clock in the night and then uh, Elsa kind of yelled at me. She, she screamed my name and then when I came to the bathroom she was like, the water broke. More things. More things that shall be done before we go. It, it's not that he is coming right now, but uh, I still want to be prepared. What a display. We call the place where the delivery is gonna happen. We have time like 9.30 in the morning. Um, so yes, now I'm just doing the stuff that needs to be done before uh, before we go there because we have no idea. Maybe we have like kid tomorrow or in two days. Our delivery letter. Förlossningsbreva. It's done. I'm gonna put my clothes right beside the bed. What more can I prepare now? Eat these. Brush my teeth again, cause I ate chips before. And uh, sleep. It is a good morning, and uh, we are we're going to the hospital to see if what's what's going on. Call taxi. I'm waiting here because I cannot go inside because of the corona thing. So, so I'm here and waiting for Elsa. She is inside those doors, somewhere in there. I hope everything is good in there. And she's back. I'm alive. We have to, we're going back now, we're going home. Yeah, Cause it was all good, right? Yes. 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 Everything was good and we're going home. Coming back. Whenever mm. it's happening. Mm. Or tomorrow. <laughs> I want to fix my hair before our son comes in this world. Look at, look at, oh my god, look at this mess. I want to fix it, my hair so it looks really good. So when my son pops out, he goes like, oh, look at this handsome dad. I'm so lucky. Now I'm uh, ready for my baby boy, I think. <sighs> Wait. A lot of things are happening right now and let me just sum up what are the things that are happening if this vlog is like, doesn't make any sense. The first thing was 
what I broke between Friday and Saturday, like uh, in the night. So 12.30 ish, the water broke. Uh, 12.40, 43, 45 something, we called um, the hospital to see like, okay, what should we do? So they told us like, okay, if Elsa has like a lot of pain, then she should like take pain painkillers and then if her water is like yellow or green then we should call back or if she has so much pain after the painkillers that she cannot like withstand it then we should call them again that never happened and we got a time on saturday morning we were at the hospital at 9 30 a.m and then uh, they checked like all the things that they have to check on the baby, like the heartbeat and Elsa's uh, blood uh, pressure and everything. And everything was normal, everything was good. So they told her that, uh, okay, it's all good. Still, if you have pain, then you should take painkillers. If you have a lot of pain, then you should call us if you have... Uh, yellow or green water then you should call or call us or if um, you have fever then you should call us none of that happened that was Saturday today is Sunday and we got another time today at 10:30 uh, a.m. we were at the hospital again uh, and um, the same they, they kind of told the same but they also told like Okay, if we have, uh, if nothing has happened till tomorrow, so Monday, uh, then they were, they were gonna uh, start start up igång set. Wait, how do you how do you say that? Igång setning of förlossning. Initiation of childbirth. Uh, start like uh, up the 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 childbirth for Elsa. Tomorrow, so tomorrow is Monday. We have another time at 8 a.m. this time, and then uh, yeah, hopefully, I like a baby tomorrow. I have a son tomorrow or, or day after tomorrow. I don't know how long it takes, so it's just I have no idea, no clue. Okay, this that that was just like a little mini update of what's gonna. I'm, I'm stay with us here.